Hello all, welcome to Random Art with Karen. I'm in my spiral Bible today. Uh, this is the New Testament. I have the American Standard Version. They also have it in King James Version and different uh, covers that you can choose. They've come out with a butterfly that is just gorgeous. And I'm going to be working in Philippians. Let's see, Philippians. Oh, let's see. Oh, that's where I... I've been reading through the New Testament, and uh, that's where I have stopped. I'm, I'm, I'm up to Acts right now. And, yeah, I purchased this Spiral Bible uh, last December as a Christmas gift for myself. <laughs> Why not, right? Yes. So, I'm going to be looking at the verse Philippians 4, 8. Finally, brethren, what whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honorable, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue and if there be any praise, think on these things. So I'm going to underline this verse. And I'm just using a Pilot G2 pen here. Sometimes I will use uh, a highlighter pen uh, if I have, you know, a color that uh, coordinates with the stickers I'm going to be using. You know, I saw this uh, on another YouTube channel, The Word Nerd, if you know her, and th the fact that it lays flat and I can flip it I was like, okay, I'm in on that, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, the spiral part of it, and it's lightweight, portable. You could, you know, take it to uh, church and make your notes easily there. All right, so these are printables from the Faithful Heart Shop, and that's why I put, put her name down there so I would not forget. And... I'll we'll put that there and look at this and that beautiful prayer journal. There was some floral there that I cut off. I want to cut this little part off too. And, and then the stack of Bibles. Yeah, maybe those are all different different translations as well. So I'll put that behind. Uh, I think I'll put this down first. So I use the, let me show you, when I uh, print my printables, the Mako uh, clear labels, matte finish, eight and a half by 11. Uh, the key thing on using printables and on the the clear, they're very thin, and so it won't add uh, bulk to your Bible, and uh, you won't have any problem closing it. I know I have done journaling uh, before and, you know, added different ephemera, etc., and it gets rather bulky, and uh, sometimes it gets to a point where it won't close. <laughs> Let's focus on getting this straight. Always my hope. Meditate on the word. And what is this? This looks like a little cotton. Not sure what the greenery is. I just love the, the vintage look um, of it. And let's see, just kind of Plug it up right there. And yeah, there's only one little thing through that big eight and a half by 11. So sometimes you have to play with the corner to get it, to get it started. Yeah, this would do, uh, this would be great. Like I said, portable. Uh, 
to uh, take to church when you're listening to sermons. And uh, there was a little thing there. If you go on retreats, if you have Bible studies. And I've got a little kitty up here deciding that that he wants to play right in the middle of the was. Yes, Karen wasn't smart enough to go ahead and close the door. But then sometimes what happens there is then I get this meow, meow, and scratching at the door during my video. So, let's see. I'm going to white out the page number here. And this is just some big, big white out that you can get anywhere. And we'll line that up so it's sort of even with the other the other book and do I want to add some greenery there uh, I'll think I'll think about that let me think about that um, so what I like to do on some of my pages I'm getting my tablet here is write different translations so I go to Bible Gateway there are other uh, sites out there it just happens to be the one that I prefer and I typed in Philippians 4, 8. But you can also then, like right now I'm in the King James Version. And just look at all of the different translations that are available uh, for you to choose from. So choose whatever ones. Or read several. Uh, you'll get, uh, I think, better understanding when, when you do that. And uh, Amplified. So we can look at that. And... There we go. Now it's going to the Amplified. So that's what I'm going to write, this Amplified version. And let me get that in front of me. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and flip it. And then I like to use this. And let me get back to my verse in the Amplified. Finally, believers, whatever is true. Again, you can maybe hear... <laughs> <laughs> a bit of patter <laughs> of pawpaws. <laughs> He's having fun. So I'm going to finish writing this off camera. And then when we come back, we'll look at uh, how it finished out. So just hold on here in a minute. So I finished writing my uh, translation of the Amplified of this verse, Philippians 4, 4, 8. And uh, if I had, you know, needed more room, I have written here on occasion. Still have all of this space and all of this space. So, uh, yeah, I, again, I like the, the ability to uh, flip and lay flat. That was the thing that that really got me to like, yeah, that's what I want for my Christmas present this year. And I've used it quite a bit. Uh, I'm going to be making a video and showing uh, some of my favorites that I've done. And um, maybe you'll be interested in that. So, yeah, this is the New Testament. They do offer uh, the Old Testament in, you know, digestible sizes. Like one is history, one is prophets, one is poetry, which, of course, has psalm uh, in it. Uh, they've also come out with a larger font, 16-point font in the Gospels. Um, I'm able to read this fine. Of course, I do wear reading glasses, but I am 67 years old, so <laughs> but I am still able to read this okay. All right, I will put the link below for the Faithful Heart Shop if you enjoyed her printables, and I will also put a link to the Spiral Bible, and you can see the products they have available there. And I hope you liked this video, and will become a subscriber if you're not already. And those of you that do subscribe, you know I appreciate you. Let's do the wave by. I look forward to doing some scripture writing and getting into the Word with you next time. Bye.